Hi everyone, this is Abhijit here and welcome to this tutorial. Today we'll be talking about a free application for Windows which you can download and use it to tune your guitar. So let's get started. The website URL is aptuner.com. You can check the description box below to get the URL. And there you'll find a link which says download the file aptuner install 308.exe. Right click on that and save link as you'll be asked to save uh, the exe file, save it on your desktop and it's a very small file just 1.3 megabytes and it takes a while to download let's wait for it and once it's complete go to the desktop there you'll find the exe file just double click it install and there you go your tuner is installed now go to the start bar click all programs and ap tuner 3.08 open the tuner and you'll be asked to enter the registration code And your tuner is ready and once you're in you can find a whole lot of features inside this tuner for example go to note note preset and they'll find standard E tuning for your guitar drop D tuning standard E and drop D tuning for bass guitar violin viola etc let's leave it for a six string standard E tuning and let me show you what the strings represent here you will see one two three four five six six calibrations here and these represent the six strings E2 is the low E that's the sixth string A2 is the fifth string A string D G B and last the high E string okay so now that you have your tuner installed in a computer let's see how it functions and how it tunes your guitar we'll take one string at a time we'll start with the sixth string that is a low E string and here it is named as E2 and we'll tune our guitar to E2 and the reading should be 0 that is this pointer should be at the dead center pointing towards 0 or uh, very much near it so let's start with the 6th string that is the E string So there we are at the center. Now let's proceed towards the uh, fifth string, that is the A string. Here it is named as A2, and the the reading that we are aiming at is A2 and 0, 0.0. Let's see. There we are. We cannot get to 0, 0.00, that is uh, virtually impossible. So try to get uh, as close as possible to the center reading. Proceed further with the fourth string, fifth string, and sixth string, uh, respectively. Another important thing I would like to point out here is this tuner listens through microphone. My laptop has an inbuilt webcam with it, it also has an inbuilt microphone. So it listens uh, through this microphone and uh, processes the sound and tunes the guitar accordingly with this calibrations. If your laptop doesn't have a microphone, uh, inbuilt microphone or if you're working on a desktop, so I would suggest you to get an external microphone uh, like a desktop microphone or if you don't have these then uh, you should be having a pair of earphones that comes with a cell phone and it also has a microphone over here. So this would act as a microphone and you plug it in to the microphone jack. The microphone jack is something which looks like this. This is the microphone jack and your pin goes into this jack so now your laptop or your computer is ready to uh, receive the sound from this microphone and uh, one more setting you have to do after connecting the microphone is go to recording choose recording device and calibration here you will have an option called device to use here you have to select uh, from the drop down you'll have a lot of options from there if you're connecting an external micro microphone then you'll be selecting external mic and after that you say OK and your uh, tuner is ready to uh, get the sound from the external microphone and you can tune your guitar. So uh, that's it from me. Uh, I, I think I help you guys with uh, tips on tuning your guitar and uh, if you have any questions then comment on this uh, comment section below. I'll try to answer all your questions and uh, rate, comment and subscribe. Till next time this is Abhijit signing off. Uh, take care. Bye bye.